Hey everybody, Kerry here. Today we are in Jacksonville, Florida at a card show. Let's see what we get. Right in here, guys. Let's see if we can find some deals. It didn't take us too long to find some deals. Two for five dollars autographs and jersey cards. There was tons of baseball, football, and basketball in these boxes. Right off the bat, we got a Grayson Rodriguez, one of the bigger prospects for the Orioles. I don't think he's played that well as of yet, but this is about an eight to $12 card. I'll take it. Next up, we found another decent card. The top prospect, I believe, for the Oakland A's, my team, Tyler Soderstrom. We're gonna pick that up. Should get me like five to $10, give or take. I'm kind of testing my baseball knowledge here. There's a lot of prospects, a lot of variables. I'm not looking everything up. I know Seth Beer was a big rookie last year. I know he's back in the minors now. Now, number to 199. People are asking a lot for this, but realistically, should get me about 10. Find any keepers? Yeah, I'm finding a few. I got a little. I can show you. This is just me winging it without looking stuff up. We got a Seth Beer autograph. Nice. Number to 199. Tyler Sodister. Remember, you were talking about him earlier, Dave. And then Grayson Rodriguez. Shout out to my buddy Dave and his son for filming me at this card show. We're visiting him as we're going cross country doing bargain boxing and also garage sales. Also, my girlfriend was waiting forever here while I looked through cards and had some other buddies with me as well. So shout out to everybody who could make it and hang out with me here. Ezekiel Duran, I saw him at a Rangers game a couple nights ago. Decent autograph right there. Leaf is not the best brand, but I should get about five to ten dollars. You like Patrick Mahomes? Check this out. <laughs> that, that one probably is too expensive for me, though. It's only two hundred fifty. Yeah, that's way over my budget. Sick. Cool. <laughs> what do you got? What do you got? <laughs> it's Justin Herbert, nine point five. Wow. This guy's over here buying one dollar cards. Yeah, man, I'm the, I'm the, I'm the dollar box guy. It really is true. I, I love focusing on the bargain boxes. That is my jam when I'm at a card show. Of course, you could go higher up, and at some point I may buy some cards that are bigger and share them here, but the focus of this channel is always going to be bargain box buys. It's, it's my favorite thing to do. It's so much fun. I love these fresh inks from the late 90s, early 2000s. That's numbered to 1,000. I was trying to figure out if it was a Millennium Mark. It was a popular parallel set back in the day. This Byron Laura, I did buy. I probably shouldn't. I keep seeing them in bargain boxes, so I decided to get it. It's the best, best name in baseball right there, Jansen yeah, Junk. <laughs> Jansen junk, because he throws the junk, man. I remember Dustin Harris being a prospect people were looking for in Bowman a couple years back. Here's an autograph, Contenders Optic. A recent sold was pretty bad on that, but I still think I can do decent on it, so I'm gonna pick it up. Also got this Bryce Terang. I know he was a, a decent prospect for the Brewers for a while, so I picked up his Leaf Metal. Once again, Leaf is not the best stuff, but oftentimes you can get Decent prospects at a low price, so I pick them up. Like this Patrick Bailey autograph. Patrick Bailey having a great season, great rookie season with the San Francisco Giants. I ended up finding a couple of his prospect autos in here. Riley Pint, I've heard of him. I don't know a lot, but this is numbered at 25. Had to pick that up at that $2 range. I decided to pick up this Luis Garcia Nationals autograph, rookie autograph. He's an everyday player for them. Not the best pickup. One's currently available at like four. Some have recently sold in like the five or six dollar range. I'm gonna pick it up though. Next up I got a Juan Yepes St. Louis Cardinals autograph mosaic. This should get me about six to eight dollars. Nothing too crazy. We got a Yaliki Cespedes. He wants us his brother. Number to 99. Cool looking card. I think that's maybe like a four to six dollar card. Maybe a little more. This is a great card right here to find in the two for five dollar box. Patrick Bailey. Number to 25. That card should get me 25 to 35 dollars shipped. That's why I love looking through these boxes. You're gonna find a lot of bread and butter stuff, stuff that'll get you four, five, six, seven dollars. But you're gonna find a couple really good cards like that if you keep digging. Osmani Dieng was a lottery pick in last year's NBA draft. This is number to 25 Leaf Pro set. Pretty cool card. Should get like five to twelve dollars shipped on it. Pretty hyped up for the NBA season. I like going through this box of prospects. Jeremiah Robinson Earl decent prospect for the OKC Thunder. That should get me like three, four or five dollars right now. Could go up maybe when the season starts. I'll probably sell it long before then though. 
Kennedy Chandler autograph coming up. He was a rookie last year for Memphis. I'm going to pick that card up as well. I was pretty stoked to find this Mario Chalmers autograph from this year's products, Luminance, number to $199. This should get me about $6 to $8 shipped. Not a bad find. Member of the championship teams with LeBron James and the Miami Heat. Remember when you see the comps on these cards, I'm only charging like $0.61 cents to ship my cards at the standard envelope. Getting this Kendall Brown to $25, he's on the Pacers, should get about $6. Seven dollars shipped on it. Unfortunately, I only show this card briefly, but it's a 1991 Pro Line autograph. These are awesome. A lot of times, people will pass these up because they look like nothing, and the autograph is on the back, which is kind of weird. But these typically do like five or six, seven dollars on the low end. This guy's on Denver. I, just, I have a problem. I love these Leaf cards, and they're not always great. Now, these are, you are Denver fan? Uh, not particularly. Okay, because I thought out that way. Yeah, Raiders. Raiders. Oh, Raiders. Yeah, this. You know, I just love these because you don't see these every day. These. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is actually pretty good. This one, I wouldn't be surprised if it's 15 or 10 to 20. Who is, is that? Phil Jerkovic. He's still on Boston College. He hasn't been in the draft. Kendall Brown's on the Pacers. Yeah. Chandler's on Memphis. Just thought it was cool to see any Mario Chalmers auto. Another Kennedy Chandler. These are not big come-ups. I just liked him in Summer League a little bit. Yeah. Deang was really good in Summer League. Um, Levers, I had kind of taken a flyer. Did you get some of the games? I didn't hear. Yeah, I went to two days. Okay. So, yeah. Is that's a, the other Cespedes is his little brother. Yepes was good for a little bit. I don't know if he still is. Garcia, I believe, is a starter for Washington. I just got that because it's low numbered. Riley Pint. Yeah. Bryce Turing. I think it's uh, Milwaukee. Yeah, really Dustin Harris was a decent in Bowman last year, so we'll mm -hmm. see. Bison Laura, I see that dude all the time. I think he's good. <laughs> We're gonna take a chance. Yeah. Duran, I saw him. I went to a Rangers game the other night, and he's Is he's playing. Right? He's playing in Texas. He's a Ranger. He's oh, Ranger. Okay. Grayson Rodriguez hasn't really panned out, but he's a big prospect for um, Baltimore. Is that box that much? Dollar? Uh, they're $2. two fifty each. So two, two for five. He seems like he'll negotiate, but I don't know. I'll probably he's given. It's already a decent enough deal. Although I am gonna put this card. Probably put these two back because I gotta put two back. What's up, man? Hey, video. oh, thank you, bro. Saw you were just in Texas. Yeah, how you doing, man? Thank yeah. you, bro. Pleasure. Nice to meet you, dude. So I am going through this box, and I'm not comping stuff as I go. And when you do that occasionally, you're gonna get a bad buy. Jalen Rager. I know he played for the Eagles for a while. That's not worth much of anything. I probably should have passed on that. I picked it up. I'll still sell it probably make most of my investment back. I keep hearing about Cam Ward from Gaby's card stacks, so I decided to take a flyer on this autograph card. It is a leaf card, but it's an auto. We're gonna see how it does. Gage is here. He watches the channel. I watch all your videos. Oh, dude. Yeah. Gage, nice to meet you, man. How are you? Yeah. Good. Just looking at cards, dude. Yeah. How are you? You found anything cool today yet? Yeah, he's got a found Debo Samuel. Found some stuff in the dollar boxes. Awesome, dude. Did you show any of it? To, yeah. Yeah, yeah you did. Me good card. Found some stuff? Sick. Yep. I'm in the, this autograph box is pretty fun. You should check this one out when you have time. It's good to meet you, man. Nice to meet you, too. Yeah, that's awesome, man. Yeah. You out here, you from Jacksonville? Uh, from right near Jacksonville. Right near? Around Gainesville. Awesome, man. Hold it. It's good to meet you, bro. Good to meet you, too. Awesome, dude. It's all your series crossing. Oh, yeah. This will be the, this will be like the third video I think yeah. I do, and then hopefully I can get like another four or five done all before right. I head back to Vegas. But I live way out on the other side of the U.S., so. Yeah. It's awesome. It's good to meet you, man. Nice to meet you, too. Appreciate you, dude. 50. 50. We'll do it. Sounds good. Awesome. Thank you. You're welcome. Since you spent so much time. I had fun. 30 for 50. So, wow, that's not bad at all. It's even better than 250 each. Awesome. Thank you so much, sir. Appreciate you. Of course, dude. Yeah, let's do it. I'm just saying. There we go. Nice to meet you, Thompson. Appreciate you, man. Of course, man. Yeah. This is awesome. Dude, this is weird for me, man, but I'll do it. <laughs> I appreciate it. No, always, dude. Yeah, bro. Appreciate you, brother. You. What was your name again? Andrew. Andrew. Card Vibe Online. Card Vibe? Yes, awesome, sir. dude. You on Instagram? Uh, I am. Card Vibe. Awesome, dude. Forward in the card show. I think that'd be cool. Am I doing some B-roll? <laughs> Let me get out of the way. I gotta be normal. We're on to a new vendor and everything in this box is half the sticker price. I come across this nice Josh Rosen. I know he's out of the league, but this is five of six. Super low numbered rookie card. I'm gonna take a flyer on this at five. I think I can get like 15 or 20. A decade ago, Billy Hamilton was a major baseball prospect. These are both 250 a piece and auto numbered to 50 rookie card. And I also got a nice like quad jersey card right here 
He's still with the White Sox. I think he's in the minors. I'm not exactly sure what's happening with him now. He's still in the league, I believe. So I'm going to pick those two up. I ended up passing on the other big patches, but I did get those two Billy Hamilton cards. This next card is one of the better finds of the day for $250, a Max Kepler Gold Refractor rookie card to $50 for $250. That's insane. Uh, the lowest one on eBay right now is 110. There's no recent sales. I think I can get like 40 or 50 dollars on it. I think that's solid. Maybe I can get upwards towards that hundred dollar range. Found another 50% off box. So these are 250 each. Going to pick up that Jeff Malone and Greg Ostertag Utah Jazz PC card. That's my second Greg Ostertag auto for my collection. So I'm super stoked about that. The Jeff Malone I imagine will get me like five to ten dollars shipped. I took a flyer on this Laredo Kid History of Wrestling autograph for two fifty. Looks like it'll get me like seven, eight, nine dollars. So not a bad buy. Still the cows come home. Yeah, this I'll just this stuff just came out. Score. New stuff. Oh yeah, I pulled a one one Bryce Young. Whoa. Rookie. Are you serious? Right down there. Uh, yeah. I gotta check that out if you don't mind. I just want to see. Right there. Dude. That's, That's hard up. to see, but it's uh, yes, it says one on one. Yeah. That's awesome. We, we got it. it I, I opened a box. The first box had an auto way at the bottom, and it was backwards. Yeah. Second pack had his card backwards. In the same place. I'm thinking, oh my god, I got a Bryce Young autograph. Yeah. So Even better. Over. Well, I flipped over. I was pissed. I was like, oh, well, what they put that thing backwards for? You and didn't I notice look, the 101. It blends right in. <laughs> yeah. It and, doesn't look like anything fancy, no, does it? Until you until you go in that angle and see 101, then I was like, holy crap. That's that's in perfect timing, man. Perfect timing. I love it. Could you imagine opening a box of score football and getting a one of one of anybody, honestly, but then getting a one of one of Bryce Young? That was insane. I can't believe he pulled that. He should definitely get that graded. I don't grade a lot of stuff, but that's a card you definitely need to get graded. As you can see, we're in the country, guys. We are in Georgia right now on our way to North Carolina. I've been doing the voiceover here in the car. It's kind of fun editing as you go. I hope you enjoyed this video. Shout out to Dave for filming me. It was a lot of fun. Also, I want to shout out my sponsor for this bargain boxing across America adventure, Collects the Marketplace, Collects Marketplace. I have cards currently on there that you can buy. It's under my name, Carrie Williams. You can go on there, you can buy, you can sell. It's awesome. You can scan your cards, you can post them. Definitely get into it, guys. They're super great at Collects. They also do Card Dealer Pro, which helps me list tons and tons of cards on eBay every day. So go check out the marketplace, check out my cards, list some stuff yourself, go find some deals and buy also. Thanks guys so much for watching and I'll check y'all next time.